Hi guys, welcome to our Daily Encounter. Today we read about the various victories that Joshua has with the children of Israel against the various kings in the land. And we see that he overtook some 31 kings uh, while going through the land and, and fighting against them. And as those kings fought against him, uh, he was able to bring the land under subjection to God's kingdom, to Israel. And as we reflect on that, we can say that uh, we ought to have a similar experience uh, in our hearts that they had with the land. Just as Joshua went through the land and uh, went against all those opposing forces in the land and brought the land under subjection to God, so we ought to do with our hearts. Any opposing force in our heart, any misplaced allegiance, any uh bad desire that we have that that runs in opposition to God, everything that's in our hearts that is against the purposes of God need to be brought down and need to be destroyed and need to be brought under subjection to God. And this is done by us being uh, completely connected to Christ, fixed on Christ, taking up our cross and following Christ and making our lives centered around Christ. It is Christ who will bring the victory over our hearts if we will but uh, subject ourselves to him, love him with everything that we have, and be devoted to him absolutely. Uh, Joshua brought the people, the children of Israel, into victory, and Christ can also bring us into victory as well. And with the desired result being that every part of our heart, any anything that is uh, against the Lord, will be brought into subjection under the Lord so that Christ can rule through and through and that the kingdom of God will uh, have its proper place in our hearts uh, continually and absolutely. And so let's bring this to the Lord today. Let's spend some time in prayer with the Lord and say, Lord, is there any part of my life, any part of my heart that hasn't been absolutely given over to you. And if so, Lord, help me to have the victory over those areas of my heart in my life. And I want to bring all of those things under subjection to Christ, to where Christ truly is the king of my heart, and that the kingdom of God is truly ruling in my heart, to the point that I am absolutely given over to the plans and the purposes of God. So hopefully we can have that type of heart. Hopefully we can have that desire in our lives and be encouraged to do so as we read about Joshua and the various victories that he had in the land. So these are some things we can reflect on and think about as we do our reading today. With that, guys, I do thank you for watching the video today. Hope you guys have a great day. Love you guys. God bless.